Yes, my lions, <clears throat> the hidden shrine. You all doing okay? Hope so. Oh, I was having a right run around, trying to plug everything in at the last minute, and it's no good, is it? What's the what's the what's the phrase? More haste, less speed, or something. <clears throat> I did all my shirt buttons up the wrong way again. You get to the bottom, and you got kind of a you know, one flat longer than the other. Had a great weekend, though. a couple of lovely, lovely gigs. Nice to see a load of you in Scarborough. <clears throat> Carl, I see you're in the house. Coming to you in Wimborne soon. <clears throat> and uh, But I'm in the doghouse because I forgot to mention that I wasn't coming home last night. I wanted to stay and walk up a mountain. Which I did. And then got to get out of this doghouse somehow. A bit of Simon Goulding will go up. That will help. That helps with everything. Yeah. Thank you. 
Yes, our Simon very much still with us in our hearts, in our minds, <clears throat> and in our music. I see on my screen a haiku is in from Mr. Yak. Right. I always got to rehearse these in my mind before I, before I say them. Right. Dappled sunlight glows, sakura blossoms revealed beauty arising. Dappled sunlight glows, sakura blossoms revealed, beauty arising. The sakura, of course, is the, the cherry blossom. I wonder if any Zen Denners are <coughs> going to Japan for the, uh, the cherry blossom this year. We're not. You can't be everywhere, can you? <coughs> Mambo in, that was called. Mambo in. Oh, what's coming next? Uh, and last night we played in Threlkeld, over near Carlisle, kind of thing. Um, so, Threlkeld is kind of nestles at the bottom of Blencathra. So we walked up that this morning. Well, Dave couldn't because he had a poorly foot, but everybody else did. And uh, on the road, you know, there's a, the drives are quite long sometimes. So I've been sustained by bananas. I went, I went into the primary school, my local primary school last week, uh, to take the choir. You know, my good deed. Um, I love it. It's always fun. And uh, Mrs. Z, the headmistress, she said to me, uh, this is rather a personal question, she said, but um, do you like bananas? I said, well, I should do. I'm a right monkey, aren't I? So um, I said, we, can, we, we would deliver too many. Would you like a bag of bananas? <coughs> so, of course, I said yes. <coughs> and uh, so I was walking down the road from the school to my house with a bag of bananas. I was dying for somebody to say, why have you got a bag of bananas in your hand? But nobody did. <coughs> so I remember once seeing somebody walking down the street. I think it was in Tokyo, I think. With a massive bag of bananas. I was just dying to say, what have, you, what have you got all those bananas for? But I never did. I was too shy. And anyway, I, I don't even know the Japanese for bananas. Oh, yeah, I do. Because uh, <clears throat> haiku guy. Basho. That's it. That's one word for bananas. <laughs> Basho means banana. Hey, great, yeah. That's, uh, and I've got a verse from uh, Danny coming up later as well. Four years we've been at it, apparently. This is the anniversary, the four-year anniversary of when we first did the live streams. Oh, man. That was a crazy time, wasn't it? Crazy times. Thought lockdown was only going to last two or three weeks. We did a live stream every night. <clears throat> and here we are on show number 4,003,032. Cheers to you all. <clears throat> so a friend of the stream, young Jacob Smith, <clears throat> who was an absolute star in that same choir about 13 years ago. <laughs> friend of the stream, of course. We, we've, we've had him on featured many times, haven't we? Well, he was down round here, down the Zen Den, recording some uh, pieces for his girlfriend's film which is um, which she's working on <clears throat> and uh, just brought his violin didn't bring the big old bazuma phone what doing that for and uh, he's playing really beautifully and we recorded a couple of pieces we, we might sail out tonight with one of them you know over the end credits <laughs> end credits but um, so while he was here, I said, Jacob, 
would, would you mind playing on you know this I've got this tune I want to do for for the guys in the den and it'd just be perfect with a bit of you on it and I wrote a little string arrangement and uh, well, he was a, he was a kind of prisoner really he had to say yes <clears throat> he would have said yes anyway and he did he played beautifully and uh, it's a bit of a strange concept because this is a tune by a song by Eleanor McAvoy wonderful singer I've always just fancied singing but it's, a, it's it's very much written from a woman's perspective by a woman it's called only a woman's heart but I, I don't know hey this modern age I can sing it can't I <clears throat> uh, Judy Bridge if you are listening this is for you and uh Big thanks to Jacob for doing this. <clears throat> and for Joe for stitching it all together. What do I need? Oh, maybe this later. <clears throat> do I appear to be a bit untogether? <laughs> it's all those bananas. <clears throat> Gone to my head. Cheers. <clears throat> yes, we have no bananas. Right. Concentrate.
woman's heart can be. Yeah. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Yeah, Mr. Jacob Smith. Plays great. <laughs> Tells me he's, he's involved in some kind of a drinking competition tonight. I need more. <laughs> I need to know more. <clears throat> I, I was in a drinking competition the other day. It was called uh, Beer Pong. It was, I did a, I did a workshop, saxophone workshop on the, the south coast, organised by a, a good mate of mine. And as an icebreaker, we played beer pong, where you have to, if you if you manage to get the the ping pong ball into your opponent's um, glass, do you have to drink it or they drink it? I think you have to drink. I can't remember. I can't remember. It's not surprising, is it? And I can't remember what you have to do to win either. Beer pong. Got a little bit. Dis some of the students got a little bit disturbed because this ping pong ball was all over the floor and everything, and landing in your drink. <laughs> anyway, nobody died. Jacob, you're watching, mate. What kind of state are you in? <clears throat> you're welcome in my studio anytime, mate. Anybody is, but especially you. Well, <clears throat> Gareth Moulton is on my mind because uh, he's coming south. He now lives in Fife. He's coming to play the ropery. Just, with, just little him and little me on Sunday. I love the rope walk. Yes, mate, I am enjoying my IPAs. <laughs> Jacob's he's got booze on the mind. <clears throat> oh, what do I need for this? What are we going to do? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, <clears throat> so you, you'll, you'll remember early lockdown doors, nearly four years ago. Um, Gareth was locked down up in Fife, and we were locked down here, obviously. And uh, so we did a couple of remote hookups, and uh, this is one of them. Welcome to the shed in Kettle in Fife, uh, where it's a beautiful day. And uh, as we enter our second year of isolation, <laughs> I thought I'd play um, an appropriate tune. It's called um, Still Crazy After All These Years. <laughs> Met my old lover on the street last night. She seemed so glad to see me, and I just smiled. So we talked about the old times, and we drank ourselves a beer. I'm still crazy after all these years. I'm still crazy. Tends to socialize. I seem to lean on old familiar ways. And I hear no fool for love songs that whisper in my ear. I'm still crazy after all these years. I'm still crazy. Oh, I'll never worry. Oh, 
should I hide? And it's all gonna fade. I know it's all gonna fade. My favorite cup And that's why I know Yes, I know Hallelujah I love her so When I'm in trouble And I have no friend I know she'll go with me Till the end Everybody asks me How I know I smile at them And say she told me so I know I know Hallelujah I love her so if I call her on the telephone Tell her that I'm all alone By the count, I'll count of one to four She'll come knocking on my door In the evening when the sun goes down When there is nobody around She kisses me and she holds me tight She tells me, honey, everything's all right That's why I know, whoa, I know I count from one to four I hear her on my door In the evening when the sun goes down When there is nobody around She kisses me and she holds me tight Tells me, honey, everything's all right That's why I know, yes I know Hallelujah, I love her so Oh, hallelujah, I love her Oh, hallelujah, I love her so Oh, that one's fun. I don't know if I've ever done that one before for you guys. In fact, I'm not sure I've ever done it for anybody. Oh, the voodoo dance requested in. All right, Jen, you might have to remind me. But I'm going to put it on the list for you. The voodoo dance. 
Not tonight, though. I need to practice it. Rehearse. It's an unfortunate thing about the older mind. <laughs> you learn something, you get it match fit. A couple of days later, it's gone. <clears throat> so, um... <clears throat> Danny Walker, Danny and Viv, they were at the Scarborough show. And uh, <clears throat> having a good time. And so uh, Danny was moved to write a verse. Now I'll give you a bit of the back history. Our Mike Cole, <clears throat> resident stream documentarian and super fan <clears throat> and friend, friend of the den, friend of us all. Um, he said, Snakey Boy, you had not played in Scarborough for a while. And I said, yeah, I think they might have fallen out with this because the, you know, the uh, promoter lady had left or retired and couldn't get any joy. And he said, I'll go down and have a word. <laughs> Next thing you know, we've got a gig. Yeah, should be an agent, mate. <laughs> So, yeah, yeah, that's the backstory. So, the verse. Mike begged, give us snake. The band rocked a sellout crowd. Sacks by the seaside. I love that. Sacks by the seaside. That's got a real ring to it. I like that. Here's a tune. <clears throat> called Breathing.
a tune what I wrote with my mate Will Mowat. And he got out of music. He was doing ever so well. He was a keyboard player and kind of a bit of a producer, musical director for Jazzy B, Soul to Soul. <coughs> and uh, produced some lovely records. Not kind of massively successful, more like sort of lovely African y tinged ones and things like that. But in the end, <coughs> in the end, he said, I've had enough. So I'm going to get a proper job. So he got a job as a translator. He's making far more money than any of us lot. But is he having so much fun? I don't know. Probably is, actually. Let's get Gareth back. One more. This is one of his songs. Beautiful song. Okay, this is a song uh, called Cloud Cover, um, which I wrote when I was a million miles away on tour, feeling lonely. And it's about how, um, even though you're separated from the people you love by thousands of miles, you can still be connected. So it's kind of appropriate. Despite there not being a cloud in the sky today. It goes like this.
the wonderful, the one and only. <laughs> He's a great boy. So if you're anywhere in the north of England, next Sunday night, 31st, possibly. Next Sunday night, anyway. Week today. Come to the Ropery Hall in Barton on Humber. And have a lovely time with me and Gareth. <clears throat> and then the following week, if you're anywhere in the south of England, come and have a lovely time with us in either Havant or Great Torrington in Devon or... Oh, and then we're weaving our way back up via Worcester, a lovely venue called Huntingdon Hall, converted church. Then the week, then the week after we go back down and we do, this is a test, Wimborne, not far from Bournemouth, Ashburton, back in Devon, St. Alstall, down in Cornwall, and then Linton, I've never been to Linton, have you? It's up in northwest Devon, it's supposed to be beautiful. We need you. <laughs> We've never been there before and it hasn't sold many tickets. So come on, guys. Even if you've got any friends, ring them up. I'll send them a postcard. Go and see old Snakey. He's all sad because there's not many people coming to Linton. Shut up, Snakey. Shut up. A couple more tunes. A couple more. Um, right. I'm going to attempt this without a safety net. For... Kevin and Jane Lee and I've got a lot of requests in at the moment the other Kevin Jane the other Kevin Jane have um, given me a request but it's a bit more challenging got to get, got to get fakey on the job <clears throat> actually this one's challenging enough right Has my reed gone wobbly? Nobody likes a wobbly reed. Excuse me one second. Okay, we'll have a go. <clears throat> it's a tune that Dave Stewart wrote, I think, for um, him and Candy Dolpha to do as a duet. It's called Lily Was Here.
That's a lot of fun. Always good to see you. Always good to have you in the bosom of my Zen Den. Our Zen Den. Me, Sally and Joe. Big thanks to my wonderful roster of guest artists this evening. Jacob Smith back in the house. Yay! Gareth Moulton warming up for his Sunday in Barton on Humber. Nestling under the shadow of the southern end of the Humber Bridge. Of course, our wonderful Simon Goulding, ever with us. Who have I missed? I wouldn't have any fakey. Sally and Joe working so hard behind the scenes, of course. Zoom karaoke gave us some of these backing tracks. So one for the road. And of course, Yak's haiku was... Um, Inspired by the fact that we've uh, sailed into spring, officially. And uh, earlier today felt quite spring-like, but then it's flipping cold and it's going to rain tomorrow, isn't it? <laughs> gives, us, gives us Brits something to talk about, though. I'm cold and I'm wet, as usual. <clears throat> so... I want to finish with uh, a tune called It Might As Well Be Spring. Beautiful jazz standard. No idea who wrote it. And, uh, and then we'll play out with um, a bit of Jacob Smith playing a bit of Massenet. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. So... Might see you at the ropery. Hope so. I don't know when I'm back down here. I think it might be three weeks again. Or is it two? I don't know. I'm going to have a look at my time. Or maybe Sally's told you. I don't know. Where am I? This is so unprofessional. Where am I? Where am I? Yeah, it's going to be th it's going to be three weeks, I think, until we can get together again down here. But we'll let you know. <clears throat> but I'll see you all out on the road, won't I? The Northerners can come to Barton, and the Southerners. I've got a right old big choice. <clears throat> so one for the road. <laughs>
it might as well be spring. <clears throat> I'll have to put the words up for that if I, if I ever play it again. Beautiful words. <sighs> Maybe I'll sing it. Maybe I won't. Guys, sorry I rub it on some. I should do one more. I only play and don't talk, shouldn't I? We're all rushing to say yes. <laughs> Big thanks to you all, all the musicians who joined me tonight, and Sally and Joe, and especially you guys. Thanks for being here. It's a, it's a, it's a place of safety, isn't it? And warmth. <laughs> you guys take care. Okay, but we'll play out with it. A bit more, Jacob. See you very soon.